there are two main issues, I think, about why we don't have robots in our homes or working with us out of doors. The first one is a hardware challenge, has to do with batteries. It's one of the challenges we're facing with hybrid cars. We can't power our robots without a cable to an electrical socket for a long period of time. The other challenge is intellectual, which is that we don't really understand what we mean by intelligence. How is it that we accomplish tasks in the real world? So a robot in a Ford factory will weld the door of a car, then the next car comes along, it welds again, and so forth. So we know how to build machines that do the same thing over and over again. But the moment you move outside of a factory to the out of doors or into our homes, nothing is ever the same twice. I see the, the short-term future for robotics is building these machines that can go out into our world and do very simple tasks. So one application that I'm interested in is construction. Can we deploy robots at a construction site where they're moving material from point A to point B? It sounds relatively simple, but you could see how machines like that would start to work alongside humans and allow us to build things on a larger scale, to build them more cheaply. <laughs> The necessary components of a robot is that, uh, first of all, it has some intelligence. So you have a computer on board, something like your laptop, and what sets a robot apart from a computer is that the robot can sense what's going on around it. This social robot uh, watches another robot which acts as a teacher and that robot tries to learn from that teacher. So this is a project that has to do with robotics and also developmental psychology. And one of the things that we all go through at a very young age is that very quickly we learn how to imitate. So we repeat what mommy or daddy does. That's something that you see in infants and we're trying to teach our robot to do that. To start by imitating the teacher, but to then eventually go beyond the teacher and be able to improve on what they're seeing the teacher do.